Hey kids, I thought with Easter coming up this weekend that I would show you how to make an Easter bunny drawing. In my class, we call these echo drawings. In other classes, you might call them directed drawings. What you're gonna need is a sheet of paper and you're gonna need a marker, pencil, crayon, something to do it with. For my kids, I always told them to use a black marker to start off with, just kind of as the outline, and then we would always get to color it at the end. But you can choose whatever color you want. So, first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start with kind of a circle oval shape right there in the middle. Then we're gonna add kind of like a little triangle. That's a backwards J. Making his little mouth right now. Give him two eyes. Now he needs whiskers. I'm gonna do one, two, three. And then do it on the other side. One, two, three. Now we're gonna come down to the bottom of the paper and we're gonna make two rainbows to be kind of his feet. And I go one, two. After that, I'm gonna make his body shape. There's an arm. And there's another arm. Start with his right ear. The right ear is over on this side. I'm gonna make a line going all the way up to the top of the paper. And then make another line a little bit apart from that. Go all the way up to the top. Now you're gonna need a line going inside. Another line going inside. Now on this side, we're gonna make it like his ear is kind of folded down a little bit. So it's gonna look a little silly, but at the end, hope, hopefully it'll look like a fun bunny ear. So I'm gonna make a line like that. It's kind of curvy. So I'm gonna start right there and go up a little bit. And go all the way around. And then start kind of in the middle of that weird shape and go down. And then right here, go down. Good job. So you kind of made like his ear is folded over like that. The next thing we're going to do is make this kind of decorative. We're going to give him a bow tie and some fun stripes in his ears. We're gonna give him stripes in this ear too. Now we're gonna give him a fun bow tie to wear. The first thing we wanna do is make kind of a rectangle-ish shape right there. And we're gonna make a line down. We call that diagonal. Make another line kind of coming off of the top. Make a curvy line going sideways. Now on this side, make a diagonal line. Make another line coming out. Then make another kind of curvy line. Now his bow tie can be striped like his ears. So let's make some stripes on that. I'm gonna do three lines, and I did them kind of curvy. One, two, oh, that side I don't really have enough room. I'll just leave it at two. 
Let's give them a fluffy tail. To make a fluffy tail, I'm gonna make a rainbow shape. And then guess what? We're just gonna make a bunch of little rainbow shapes until we touch the ground or touch his foot or something like that, then we can be done. Now we have our Easter Bunny. On the side of it, if you know how to write letters, you can write Happy Easter on the side. If you don't know how to write your letters yet, you don't have to write this. H, A, P, P, Y. That spells happy. Happy Easter. Now Easter I'm gonna have to write tiny because I didn't leave a lot of room. Maybe I should have written it down here. Happy Easter. It's a capital E because Easter is a holiday so we capitalize it. A, S, T, E, oh, and I have to scree squeeze in my R, and an exclamation point. Happy Easter. Good job. So you are all done drawing it. Now's the fun part. Now you get to color it. Now it's time to color our bunny. I got a couple of markers out. I'm gonna use some pinks and a blue. We're gonna color his bow tie and the stripes on the ears, his nose, and give him a little bit of pink for his cheeks. After that, then we're gonna color the background with a crayon or with watercolor, but we'll do that at the end. So first I'm gonna do his nose. Then I'm gonna give him some cheeks. What I do for that is make a circle, and then I just color in my little circle. And I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side, make a circle, and just color it in. And we make those pink. Now I'm gonna do the stripes on his bow tie and his ears. I'm gonna use blue and pink just because those remind me of Easter -y colors. You can use whatever colors you want though. And it's fun to make a pattern. I'm gonna do an AB pattern on mine. I'm gonna do the same thing on this side. When I color, I try my hardest to stay in the lines. Now I'm gonna do the blue. Same thing on this side. Oh, he's looking so cute. Now we're gonna do the bow tie and I'm gonna use my same colors again on it. I'm gonna do the middle of it all blue. Just for fun, since this is just a playful bunny and we know it's not a real bunny, I think I might color his tail pink too. Because I'm just having fun with this. I'm using my imagination. But we know in real life that a bunny's tail is white. There you go. Now I'm gonna get a crayon and color the background. If you have paints at home, it'd be really fun to watercolor the back of this as well. I'm gonna go get a crayon. I'm gonna color in the background. I chose a pink crayon. You can choose any color you want. I would choose whatever your favorite color is.
And there you go. You are all done with your bunny drawing. Now, a good thing to do for this would be maybe hang it up on your fridge or on a wall in your house. You can make more of these and send one in the mail to grandma or to somebody else in your family that's maybe missing you during this time. So, happy Easter, kids.